Have you ever had one bad thing happen in your life and then it spirals out of control with a bunch of other bad things happening? If you have, we can certainly be friends. Please like and subscribe. Thank you for joining me here on The Law and Life. I'm your lawyer, Patrick McGannett. I am your best friend. This guy, Gary Busey, he just has a real problem. He was, you know, charged this week with several counts of criminal sexual conduct. There's a few more, de more details coming out from TMZ and the Daily Beast. And he's alleged to have put his face close to a woman's breast and asked where she got them. The woman claims he attempted, to un he attempted to unstrap her bra. Another woman claims he grabbed her butt. And the cops, cops also got a call from a man who claimed Busey grabbed his daughter's butt as well. So when something like this happens to these celebrities, of course, TMZ is going to follow you around. And that's just what they did in Gary's case. They followed him around at Point Doom Park and then confronted him at a gas station. You can watch the video and I'll link to both the articles down below. Gary was seen in the park with his pants down. What he was doing, I don't know, but when confronted, he said he was something about he was adjusting his knee. Really sad situation for this guy. You know, he's 78 years old. He really hasn't had, you know, a great acting career since the 70s. And he suffered a, a terrible injury in a motorcycle accident back in the 90s. And he's just acted weird ever since. He just comes up with this off-the-wall behavior. And it's really sad to see. I wish somebody would step in and help him out. But it looks like the spiral has begun. Hopefully, he, uh, he cuts it off. He takes corrective measures, or somebody does, and gets his life back together. Sad thing is, is he has a 12-year-old son who you know goes to school, I'm sure, in Malibu somewhere. And he has to deal with his friends and them making fun of his dad, I'm sure. I'm sure it just doesn't stop with his stupid behavior. It, it affects the whole family. But it's the guy's just a weird guy, and he's just getting weirder by the day, it seems. And back to his criminal case in New Jersey, where he was charged with several counts of sexual conduct. He has an arraignment for August 31st, so I'll follow that and post an update if uh, anything comes out of that. A few more details on the incident should come out of that between then and now, if not at arraignment when they file the information. So thanks again for joining me here in Law and Life. Please like, if you like this content, please like and subscribe, share with your friends, help me beat the YouTube algorithm, and have a great day. I'm Patrick McGinn, and I am your best friend at your worst time.